Okay, so today we are discussing bathing suits and sarongs. This is one that I got. I got this first. And then I came across the hat, which you saw in my previous video. I put the rhinestones on. Then I found the top and then a the bottom with this cute little bow on it. And I have to show you my little waist beads that I got as well. I'll put the link on there so you'll know where to get those from. So that's what we're talking about today. Bathing suits and sarongs. Now I won't have a lot of bathing suits because, you know, people wear different sizes, tops, bottoms, things like that. Sometimes it's pretty hard to match it up. The sarongs I always have because, you know, you can wear with lots of different things. They don't all have these little balls on here. But yeah, so let's get started. This is a really nice one. I love the paisley print on here, very bright. This one has a lot of beautiful details. As you can see, the little gold accents. Then it has the ruching on the side. The shrink, the string also has the gold accents at the bottom of it. So they cut the tag out, but if I'm not mistaken from when I purchased it, it was like a um, a large. And I thought maybe I can get into it, but it was a little too bad because not as I'm gonna keep it for myself because it's very pretty. So here is the bottom. It has the same ruching on the sides with the string with the gold detail. It's a beautiful color. So again, this was a large. And I was wondering how this would look with this. I mean, it's a little bit off on the colors, but it does have some of the same colors in it. I don't know. It's up to you. For some people, it might be too much. It might. I don't know. I like it together. It was another one here, too. Let me see. I think this one might have too much turquoise in it. But this does have that turquoise blue in it. So you could probably do either one of these with this. Or just do a plain color. It depends on, you know, how much you are into colors and prints and things like that. Okay, so that's that one. And then it's this pale uh, lavender, which is a off-the-shoulder ruffle type, which is really, really cute. And this is the bottom for this one. So that one can actually go with this as well. It's a little bit darker, but it, you know, you can still get away with it. And then we also have this one right here. This brings out the purple in it. Now this one right here does have the little tassels on it. This actually still has the price tag on it. This was an apartment nine and it retails for $28. So those two will go well together. And then I also have this black and white with like a peaches pink through it. Reminds me of like a tribal. I mean, it's tribal print stuff, right? Now, I don't necessarily have um, a sarong or scarf to match this, but the colors are pretty much neutral. That you know, you could have some, have, you may have something yourself you could wear with it. It's a crisscross back. Yeah, all of the ones I have, I think, may be too busy for this. I'm one for mixed prints, but we're not gonna push it, people. Now, these two don't go together. I got the um, bottom because I thought the top I had at home matched. I had one that was like a nautical theme that I thought would go cute with this. It was stripes, but it was black and white. I thought it was navy blue, and I thought that would be cute, like a play one. You know, the nautical, the flag, all of that, but it was a black and white stripe, so. We're on the 4th of July. So I put these together. They don't go together, but I was just doing it for, like, you know, color purposes. This top I want it for myself, but I don't know. I can't see. It doesn't look right on me. I don't know if I did it wrong. Like, I was trying to figure out how it was supposed to go. It just, it didn't lay right on me. So, but it's really cute. It's weird the way it goes. Um, it has a crisscross in the front here. Can you see that? It crisscrosses around the back, and then it ties at the neck. This is already, you know set up there's no tie or nothing so for me this was a little too loose in my back I guess I'm too small in the back or too small in the front so either somebody with some bigger boobies or a wider back this will look cute on but it just it bagged too much for me but I thought it was so cute so again ties here this loose strings wraps around tie in the back and then you have this so it's a lot of security if you have the right amount of bosom for it 
Now these are one off like me, just one pieces I found. Um, this looks red, but it's more of a reddish pink. It's really cute. It's too small for me, but it was priced right, so I got it. A lot of times I buy just the tops because I figure I can wear them um, during the summer, like with a jean shirt open, uh, jean shorts. Um, just, you know, you can pair with a lot of different things if you're going away and you don't want to have, you know, too much on. So, that was cute, but I can't fit it. It does not fit, but it's a pretty color. It's like, it's not red. It's it, On here, it looks like a hot pink. It's not a hot, hot pink. It's closer to a, a, a red. Now, this one right here, um, also apartment 9. This one retails for 40 and it's basically self-explanatory. It does have the ruching on the side as well. It has the padded cups. And this one right here, I definitely want it for myself. At one time, I had a gold bathing suit. Um, and I only had one part of it still left. And I was hoping this matched. I had the bottom. It doesn't look bad. Like I always say. Because one's up here and one's down here. But it's too big. I'm so mad because it's gold sequin. And y'all know I love anything that sparkles and shimmers and shines. It has a tie here and a tie in the back. But it doesn't fit me. So maybe it'll fit one of you guys. So now I'll go through the sarongs really quick. I did show you this one. This was the Apartment 9 one. It's pretty, pretty, pretty. has all of the... Um, the pom poms at the bottom, and this one right here as well. Oops, it's two of them. Drop one. Now these are different. I must say that too. These are different sizes. Like the one I have one is definitely a sarong. Um, that's why it's so big. Like I said, some of these are just plain scarves that you know you can wear it as a sarong. So that's that one. And then there's this one as well. It has the fringe at the bottom. This is pretty. I wonder if that, let me see. Now see, these look like they go well together. You know? And then a lot of times, too, people are taking the scarves and wearing them as tops now, too. So, I mean, there's so many different options that you have. This one is beautiful. Look at that. And it's the outline in the purple, and then the inside is basically a tropical, um, let me turn it this way, tropical scenery. So it's the purple, the pinks, the orange, touches of black and white. This is beautiful. I would say this is more so a sarong than a regular scarf. Now this is a peach and white. This is pretty too. But as always, I think they're all pretty. That's why I put them. This is the snake skin print. So you can wear this with a um a white, a peach, a gray, a black. It's very muted, meaning the colors aren't too dark, but there's still lots of options that you could, you know, carry or wear it with. Alright, so now let's get into the blues. This one has blue, white, and yellow. Another beautiful one. Looks like trees. Let me see that. Let me step back some. The blue, the white, the yellow. So, as you know, when I do my hauls, my stuff normally is not posted when I do the haul. So, if you see something you like, please DM me. And I can get it out to you before it even gets listed. But I usually try to have everything listed. Like, say, today is, what is today? I don't know. Oh, today is Friday. It feels like, why does it feel like a Monday to me? Alright, so if today is Friday. These probably won't be listed till Monday because um, I have events I'm doing this weekend. So you have until then to get to me so I could get it to you. This is pretty. I love these blues. It has blue, white, black, like a turquoise. This Now this is a definite regular scarf, but you could do so much with this thing. 
between jeans, white, black, like, ugh. I'm a scarf person. I think I did that for my own thigh hand. This is another pretty one. Very muted, but just beautiful. 